and they take on subway. If we could run it, if we could run it back, and do you wonder? If we could run it back, if we could run it, if we could run it back, and do you wonder? If we could run it back. Official first like full day of LA. We are at the Hollywood Walk of Fame I'm right like now. I'm like starstruck. I like I keep looking down. I'm like I'm not. I'm gonna hit someone. I'm gonna fall or something. <laughs> oh my gosh, the four tops. Me, I'm a top. I'm one of them. <laughs> What's crazy is we were literally only like 0.9 miles away from this and we did not even realize. I was like, Dwayne, I really want to go to the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Literally, we ended up being like right down the street from it. We're walking around looking at all the stars and then we're definitely going to try to get some food ASAP because I'm literally dying of a freaking headache right now. Is it not rude? We're just like walking all over our name. We finally made it to the show. Thank you so much. Thank you. We finally made it to a restaurant for some food. Bus down. That was highly needed. We are like dehydrated and buggered. We're in this cute little like mall area, like outdoor mall area, and we got to see the Hollywood sign. Y'all, we are actually close as fuck to everything. Are you like trying to get me sushi? I want you to get on this. Like, so wait, it's like, um, oh, like, so like a California roll or like, blah, blah, blah. yeah, it's like, it's like, 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 I'm like, I'm kind of doing it. I was like, what the fuck? We just ordered a little bit of edamame. Bus fucking down. Chicken fried rice. Mm. That needs some I think we're gonna try to go to like Target or Marshalls to get a jacket. We were trying to go into Forever 21. They literally had nothing. They had zero jackets. Wait, y'all, I'm I'm thriving. I'm fucking thriving. Try some cookie dough, y'all. We've been walking up and down this whole street all day. All day. Is it good? Which one are you gonna try? Oh my gosh. Try the salted caramel truffle, please. This More of so me. The lemon meringue cheesecake. Is that good? Yeah. We also have a regular cheesecake right here. Can I try the s'mores one? It looks like it'd be good. Y'all, we're having such a good time. Some stuff. I got you some little jacket and I got a little hat. Okay, let's try it. We're in Cookie Dough Dreams, by the way. This is gonna make me thirsty. No, I, that's what I just said. I didn't mean thirsty. Yeah. Look how cute. I'm putting that aside. I need money. Okay, so we're about to go to Dobrik's Pizza. I didn't even know this was a thing. And then Dwayne was talking about it, so we're gonna go try David Dobrik's Pizza. Okay, so we just got our pizza. We got the spicy vodka pizza and then the meat lovers. I'm excited. Me too. Ah, David Dobrik. Where are you at, babe? <laughs> yeah, hey babe, uh, I got the pizza just missing the Tesla. Uh, do you mind? <laughs> when I tell you, this fucking pizza looks absolutely insane. I'm off. I know, I'm like, we're such classy bitches. I'm gonna try the spicy oh, vodka. Fuck. Is it bomb? Bomb? Mm. The dough is doughing. The dough is doughing, hell. I mean, he's dough break. <laughs> <laughs> no, I feel like this one's kind of like mid. Like it's good. I think it needs more sauce. Yeah, like good, but I would give that one maybe like a six out of ten. Like could be better. Maybe like cheese bread. Let's try this meat lovers one. I need me some meat. <laughs> cheese bread. Oh yeah. Mmm. That one's better. I know that's my favorite one. That one's way better. Meat lovers is so usually my favorite. 
Cool, cool. I did the same thing. I did the same thing. Yep. This one is bomb. 10 out of 10 for that one. Said this one could what? Use more sauce? Did you even try that one yet? Yeah, like it's giving like more cheese bread. But I like the it's bread. Good, like that's good pizza. But I need Domino's. Good. Yeah, it's good pizza. It definitely ain't Domino's. It's like fluffy. Like the crust, I thought it was going to be like too thick. Mm -hmm. But it's airy. I'm not thinking I'm Gordon Ramsay. So guys, what would we rate total, everybody? I think I would give it a solid like... I'd say like a 9. Yeah, I'd say like 8.5. I would say the meat lovers is definitely a like 10. 10 out of 10. 10 out of yeah. 10, the meat lovers is really good. The spicy vodka, I gave it like a 6 out of 10. But overall, like, you could get pizza anywhere. But, I mean, it's cool. Like, spicy you, have, you, have, you have to come... Yeah, the spicy vodka, no, you couldn't. Well, I mean, I don't know. Yeah. My but thing, I like spicy vodka. It's a cool experience. Hey, Miss Girl. I just got back to the hotel. I'm so ready to take off my makeup. You guys have no idea. We ended up going out for a little bit. We went to this, like, really chill little bar place. And the ambience was, like, really, really low. It was so cute. I'll insert some of the pictures that we took. But it was so cute and chill. So we went there for a little bit. And then we were going to go somewhere else. But we just honestly got tired. So me and Alicia decided to just come back to the hotel. And like get ready for bed and stuff. Because we're going to wake up really early and go to the hike tomorrow. But Dwayne really wanted to go out. And he has a few friends that are actually out here in LA right now. So he decided to go meet up with them. And still go out. I don't know when the hell he's going to come back. But whatever. He's living his best life. I know you fucking lying bitch. <laughs> It's currently 12.09 and I literally just got back so I'm gonna take off my makeup. I really really liked my hair like this today. It was so cute and fun. I don't know how I'm gonna wear my hair tomorrow for the hike. Oh shit, I already got wipe out. I don't know how I'm gonna do my hair tomorrow for the hike but I don't think I'm gonna wash it. I'm just hoping that like when I brush it, the gel that I put in my hair won't be like too bad. But today we were actually supposed to go to Pride and I brought like a whole Pride outfit and everything but we decided to not go because we didn't have tickets for the Megan concert she was gonna perform and we really wanted to see Megan and so we just decided to not go and then plus y'all my outfit was like very out there and i was like if we go somewhere else like i don't want to just be like walking around in my pride outfit because it's kind of it was it was out there babe but we really want to go to acl in october so i'm just thinking that i'll just wear that and then me and Dwayne wanted to be like cosmo and wanda so my outfit that i was gonna wear for pride is like perfect for being cosmo and he's gonna be wanda so i think i might just like save it and reuse it for that but today we went to the walk of fame obviously you guys saw all of this but we went to the walk of fame and that was so much fun and then we went ended up meeting with Alicia. She was literally such a doll. I'm so excited. She's gonna come to the hike with us tomorrow. She's literally like the sweetest person. She's so kind and just so like soft, soft like spoken, just very, very like sweetheart. So we had so, so much fun with her today. Thank you by the way, babe, for coming out if you see this. After we walked around that area, we went to the David Dobrik's place, had the pizza. And then we ended up coming back here and just like chilling for a little bit while like Dwayne changed his outfit and everything. And then we were gonna go out, but like I said, we just like ended up being like really really tired so me and alicia just decided to like call it my girl but i'm getting ready for bed i'm gonna brush my hair wash my face brush my teeth do a whole nine i cannot wait to take my contacts out my eyes have been so dry but so far y'all i'm loving la i'm i'm truly like having the bestest time and i will say they're the people out here are low-key like assholes i don't know there's just like no southern hospitality out here people like will not apologize for bumping into you people do not say sorry like people do not say thank you just like yeah there's like a lot of like i don't know it's just no hospitality you know what i mean but today i feel like we ran into like a lot nicer of people but yeah that is one thing about here like people are kind of like just bitchy like to themselves like don't speak to anybody like that type of vibe but anyways girl i'm about to finish getting ready for bed and then call it a night so i can wake up in the morning and go on this hike because i'm so excited that was literally like the one thing that i was like so persistent on like okay we have to we have to do this so i'm so excited the next morning good morning bestie Rise and shine, baby girl. All right. Shine. Currently 11.33. We just got to our hike. So excited. We almost were really scared because there was like a <laughs> gate and we were like fuck are we gonna even be able to like get in? But we made it. We're on our little hot girl hike. It's so freaking pretty. Look at where we're at. Ah! Looking over all of LA. So pretty. So pretty. Not too sure exactly where we're actually supposed to go to be honest. But we're gonna get there. We're gonna we're gonna do it. We also want to do a lot of walking today. We want to go to like Melrose and stuff and walk around that area and then meet up with friends later. So girl, we're gonna be tired. We're gonna be worn out. We're gonna need a nap. The amount of cardio we've gotten in, bitch, I'm gonna be skinny as hell for the amount of calories we burn. <laughs> a whole lot of walking. Like everything is just so like big here and like there's the roads, the streets, like they're all so so far. Let's do this shit. I hope I don't get poison ivy. From far away she looks so good. We haven't even made it a minute in yet. Yeah, <laughs> 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 and 
blood out a rough soul in the wound Spend a few hours on the reservoir Never broke a bone, so I'm gonna try hard To prove you wrong we made it up here this shit was not for the week at all not for the week at all but look how pretty we're at the wisdom tree i'm pretty sure that's it don't quote me i don't really know i'm not from here some guy on the way over here he told us he was like it's way worse on the way back i said wait where this was brutal just coming up here and then we didn't even get to go to the hollywood because it's like a three four hour hike to get to the hollywood sign like you have to like hike like a good other 30 40 minutes to get to the hollywood sign because it's on the other side of the mountain so we're just gonna we're gonna stop here and we're gonna be good because honestly if we do the other like we don't have water we're gonna be dead like actually dead made it to Melrose. Look y'all, Sorella Boutique is down there. We're gonna go all the way down there and like walk up all the little shops, but we just made it. So there's the outfits. I didn't even show you guys the outfit for today, but same jewelry as the other days. Top is Shein, skirt is Shein as well. Dwayne's vlogging, I'm vlogging. We're vlogging this whole entire trip and there's people staring at me, which I don't like. I'm so excited though to go to Sorella Boutique. Like I've heard so many things about it and just <laughs> so excited to be here. We're still on Melrose. It's like 5.53 now, about 6 o'clock. We just ordered our lift to take us to dinner. We're gonna go to this place called La Bohim. Bohim, something like that. I don't know, it's like an Italian place. Dwayne really wanted Italian food, which I'm fine with too, because we have really not ate today. We had like these little subs that we got from 7-Eleven the other day, but other than that, we haven't really ate much, which is not good. But girl, we've been out and about and out on the town. Got some really cute stuff from the Sorella Boutique. Like this green shirt, y'all. Fucking sick, so cute. And then I got this little like wet set type of thing. I think I'm gonna wear it as my like airport fit on the way back. And then I got this really cute dress from, kind of gave like a Shein type store, I don't know. It was really cute though. Fit me really, really nice. I'm posting like a little shop with me on Melrose on my TikTok. For some reason when I was trying to switch this over to my laptop, I literally could not get the audio to transfer. So I'm just redoing the voiceover now. But this is the little shop with me that I filmed. If you guys wanna hear the original audio, it's on my TikTok. But the first stop we made was at the Sorella Boutique and they had so much cute stuff in here, you guys. It it was limited options because I don't know if you guys know, but the Sorella Boutique actually is under like reconstruction from like some water damage that happened. So they didn't have all of their pieces available, but they did have a good, you know, variety of them as well. And then we went into this like rework store. The stuff in there was really fucking expensive. I'm not even gonna lie. It was actually insane, but it is reworked items. So I guess it suits it. All the artwork and everything that was just down the street was insane and so beautiful to look at. We ended up going into this vintage t-shirt store. These shirts were also really, really expensive, but you know I was looking at the clearance rack because I'm a girl on a budget, okay? Um, I'm a penny pincher and I will always be, so period. Um, but then we went into this little stop. This is where I got this dress, but y'all, I literally don't know the name of the store. There were so many of these stores on Melrose, so honestly, if you just go walk down Melrose, you will find... A few of the stores that have very similar items in them so this was um just some of the pieces that i tried on i really wish i would have got this green set because it was so fucking cute but the pants were just like really really long on me and then i lastly tried this dress it wasn't my favorite so yeah that was everything that i tried on shake the eggs you know period <laughs> waiting for a ride right now and just chilling we found this like little heater <laughs> so we're just sitting here waiting Okay, so we just got our food. I got the roasted lasagna and some spicy garlic edamame. And then Dwayne got the spaghetti. Let's do a taste test. So good. And then y'all, this edamame. Fucking bomb. Really delicious. The next morning. Good morning, y'all. It is a 
officially our last day in LA. It is currently 2.21. We woke up by far the latest today that we have out of any of the days. We're currently doing our OOT to talk to Wayne's getting his in. And then we're about to head off to go try the Erewhon smoothies. Fuck and, yes! and we're yes! gonna try Earth Cafe. Dwayne actually didn't know what Earth Cafe was and I was like, how the fuck do you not know what Earth Cafe is? Like, Are you new here? Yeah, like, are you new here? <laughs> like, everybody knows what Earth is, okay? But I wanna show you guys real quickly our outfits of the day. It's not getting like streetwear vibe. I'm that bitch. So. I got these pants at a thrift store and I have these Steve Madden shoes. This top is from Boohoo. I have no clue where all the jewelry is from. No clue where this is from, but bag is from Belize. This is the fit. And here's the jewelry. Got my little watch and my bracelets. But yeah, we're about to get out of the, I about to say we're about to get out of the house. We're about to get out of the hotel room and get going because we have got to catch up on lost time from sleeping in today. Um, and then we have to come back here later to get ready because we have a dinner with my talent manager, Frank. Thank you. I'm doing like a little review on TikTok, but we're also, I'm gonna film it for here for YouTube too. But we got the Hailey Bieber smoothie. It is ridiculous in here. There's so many freaking people. So we got the smoothie. I'm so excited to try it. It looks really good. I'm gonna give you an honest review of actually how it is. How good it looks. I eat it. Oh, okay, it's actually good. I know, it makes me so mad. <laughs> okay, but no, it's actually good. I don't know if it's $18 worthy. It kind of gives like Smoothie King smoothie, but it is really good. Like I was expecting it to kind of be like, I don't know, just like super healthy, not very delicious tasting, if you know what I mean, but it's actually really freaking good. I really want to try Frankie's as well. She had like a mango one. And then I thought Courtney had one, but I didn't see Courtney's like sign or anything up for hers, but she had like a black and white one. And then Frankie has like a mango one. I just decided to do the Haley one because I feel like that's like the most iconic one, you know, that comes from Air One. So I decided to try that, but I'm excited we tried it because it actually was really, really not do it again. First, my TMZ interview. Subway caught walking into Earth Cafe. Where's the pop? Where's the paparazzi? <laughs> so just kidding, but it's Damn. so cute here. Like it really is so cute. So I got a strawberry banana smoothie, and this is Dwayne's <laughs> latte. Are we freaking kidding? Does that not look so cool? <laughs> Mm. It's getting refreshed. 10 out of 10. I got the margarita pizza, and does this not look so fucking good? This is what Dwayne got. He got a little side of hummus with some pita bread and an avocado toast. He's also on live. Say hi. hi. Say hey, Miss Bean. So we're back. We just finished getting ready for dinner. Our ride is here. So I just wanted to real quickly show y'all the fits before we leave. But we're slaying. But we look good. Next morning. We are literally packing up as we speak. For some reason, I don't know why I was like this, but it was a lot easier to pack up than it was to pack like coming here. I don't know, everything fit in my bag so much better this time around than it did for some reason when I was like packing it originally. <laughs> Period, those are fucking sweats, babe. 
Sorella did it. We just made it to the airport. It's 9.29. Our flight ended up getting delayed until I think like 12 something. So it honestly worked out for the better because we were running late anyways. Yeah, we're at the airport now. Little hack, we came in from departure. So it shouldn't be as long as like, I mean, no, we came in from arrival. So it shouldn't be as long as like we were if we were to wait in line for departure. So we just have to go up the escalator and then we'll be right at arrival. Finally made it on the plane. We're heading back now. 11.55 LA time. We don't land until like 5 or 6 Dallas time. So. But actually, y'all, look, it's nice. It don't smell like roaches or nothing. This is nice. It don't smell like roaches in here or nothing. Look at this. We got the leg room. You ever seen this much leg room in a plane? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Got me a little desk. We got the seats right behind first class or whatever. We got hella, hella, hella room. Feels like fate to visualize the things that I would